And then the first time I watch the video, yeah, no one subscribe to my channel. You can media, no one share. Now for first time you be a share, me that's it. All right, guys, welcome back to You Can Media. It's been a couple of days that I posted on my YouTube channel. You know, it's not easy because I'm very busy every day. As I always say, with You Can Media, no alibis. If you've not subscribed, please subscribe. Click on the notification bell so that any time and day, anywhere I upload new videos, you get the opportunity to have it. This is Joe Philip. Yeah, today is my birthday, and you know, as I always say, um, in this world, never give up. You know, uh, today I just want to share my little life experience, which I think a lot of you are gonna learn from it. It's not easy um, when. Uh, I graduated from tertiary institution, which there wasn't any job, so life was a bit tough at that particular time. But you know, if we are focused in life, and um, let's say you know where you are going, no road can lead you there. But as there is a saying goes, if you don't know where you are going. Any road can lead you there, you know. It's not easy. Um, when I come graduated from a tertiary institution, which uh, it wasn't, it wasn't really at all. At that time, it was a bit tough. Life was not so easy. And you know, one thing that I believe is focus. Whatever that we are doing, focus. I just want to share my little um, story. Uh, at first, uh, you know, when we talk of someone who will be very successful, then I think she will bypass Joe Philip, you know. But um, I, I was I was teaching in uh, one of the senior secondary school, senior high school, way back home. But one or two incidents happened, and I need to move out of that school. Uh, so I was there, and I still remember this boy, uh, my friend. He's not a boy, this man. And I still remember this man, um, Maxi B. He directed me to a particular school that is in, uh, um, near Suedro, Aguna Suedro. Yeah. So I filed my application, then as soon as I went there. That, was, that time I was very young, and I was very skinny. So as soon as I went there, even some of the students, high school students, you know, some of them are old and bigger than me. So they told me that, hey, are you coming for an admission? That's the first question one girl and one boy asked me. They asked me, it was a bit um, disrespectful because they don't know my my status, why I'm in this school. So I, I didn't mind them. I just walked straight to the administration. Then I told them that um, I'm a new teacher. I heard that they are looking for integrated science teacher. So uh, I'm coming to try my luck. If I pass the interview, then they're going to get an opportunity to work for, with me. I will be very happy. So yeah, they gave me the, the note. Like the, the head of academics came to meet me, check my qualifications and also my experience and they got to know that yeah i really deserve the job so they are uh, before they told me that a lot of um three or four teachers has they have applied this job but looking at situation there i think i deserve the job because i have the experience as soon as they gave me the job uh, the school i think they were very, having a very big land so i checked I know that I'm very good in weeding, so I weeded the plot, then I begin to plant garden eggs. Yeah, I think that was 2015, 2016, that way, yeah. Those of you who remember whatever that I'm saying, you know. So I planted the garden eggs. It was really, really much. It came. 
So anytime I, I like I plug it or I harvest it, then I put it in a sack, then I go to the shadow market and sell it. I made some money. That's the money that I I let's say gather them together. Then let's say with the help from my my family. Then I bought um, medical forms in China. Uh, one guy who used to be my friend, but he was already in China. His name is Gershon. Gershon did a very good job for me. He got an opportunity to um, secure admission for me in um, Shenyang Medical College. Uh, I think, yeah. So, I, I, through that, I gathered myself and I moved to China. So that was how I started. So in China, you know, uh, it's not easy to pay school fees in China. So I uh, schooled for some time, then I quickly uh, find my way out. You know, I need to divert from being a teacher, uh, being a student to be a teacher because um, I got to know that a lot of people cannot speak English when it comes to um, teaching or uh, when it comes to that citizens in China. So I enrolled myself to be a teacher in China, but you know, some people might think that being a teacher in China is very easy. It's not easy as you think. I need to write some a lot of um, some qualifications in Canada. I need to write a whole lot of things. You need to have licenses. So you know, to have all those kind of things, it was a bit tough. But with the help of the Lord Mighty, I was able to get it. So I was employed as a full-time teacher in one of the best schools in Asia. Uh, I think I worked there for some time, then one or two misfortune happened, then I came back to Ghana. I came to Ghana for about two or three months, then I also did another link, and the link was successful, then I am here, you know? My motivational message for you for today as my birthday is be focused. Whatever that you are doing, stay focused. Be focused. You need not to do a lot of things. A lot of things are just material things. Like going for uh, going to buy expensive things like iPhone and other things. If your standard is not there, just associate yourself with a standard that you think will suit you. In this world, you have to know that you are not in competition with anybody. Yes, for me, that's my philosophy. I'm not in competition with anybody. Yes, it may be that others will get married, they will have babies, they will have this and this. All what I say is I'm not in competition with anybody. I know myself more than you know me. So I always appreciate myself my well-being, having life itself is more than having mansions and expensive cars. If you have life, you have everything. My name is Joe Philip. You can meet me If you've not subscribed, please subscribe. One day, I'll have time to come and share my story, the details of all what I told you today. If I have the time, I'll come out to give you the full details of what I said today. Yes, if you subscribe, you click on the notification bell so that anytime, anywhere, upload new videos, you get the opportunity to have it and comment. Yes, you're going to have the chance to win an iPhone that is not less than iPhone X. With you can media, phones are our friends. Yes. You know, we have a lot of phones. All these phones are coming to Ghana. All these phones are coming to Ghana. Yes, maybe by this week or next week. So, if you really want to have a free phone, then don't forget to share our videos. Don't forget to comment. Don't forget to watch our videos so that at the end of the day, you also get a chance to win an iPhone. Stay blessed. Yeah.